Hi everyone, my name is Kyla B. And this is the moment that I've been waiting for since I ordered it. Um, I think it's called a Zap, zap Dot? I don't know. But um, I ordered a portable washer and spinner. So although it says dryer, it's a spinner. So I'm going to unbox it and Sorry, I'm breathing heavy. I literally just brought it upstairs. So I'm gonna put the camera here, get some scissors. Maybe I'll turn the light. And we're gonna do a unboxing. So come out my dress. I don't know this, I don't, I have scissors, but for like uh oh what why would they bring it in bottoms up like that well that's quite disappointing because it's on the bottom <laughs> so we have to flip it over because I don't want to you know, do anything crazy. Okay. Oh, okay. Oh. okay. It's very tiny. But hopefully it gets the job done. So I guess this is the in holes for water and also another in holes for water. And this is the washing machine part. It's decent. And then here is the dryer. Huh. Huh. So I guess these are all the holes and everything like that. So I will hook it up, try to figure it out, and then I'll come right back. Oh, well, I guess I'll show you this first. Uh-oh. So this is the washer. It's from zero to 15 minutes and gentle, normal drain and spin from zero to five minutes. So we're gonna check it out. And this is also, I guess, the draining hose. So. I'm gonna get it set up and I'll come right back. Stay tuned. I'm moving to the bathroom. As you can see, it definitely powers like a true machine. I like that a lot. I was thinking if I wanted to add a little more um, water. And I'm happy that it's not as, it's very compact. I like that it can fit right in this little space. So, but I'm really, I really like this actually. And I guess because it is small, but you see how it's a lot of room, I would like wash whenever something needs to be washed immediately instead of letting it pile up. But yeah, I like it a lot. I will definitely come back when I put it in the dryer. And But look at the spot, the sides, I like that a lot. It's moving just a tad bit, but it's not very loud. And it's actually really quiet with it shut. So I actually like that a whole lot. Um, and so I'll go ahead and take that off. But yeah, I'll be back. I actually just figured out that it hooks up to the sink and you can do it like that so that you don't have to run back and forth for the bucket. Although the first time I did it, I used the bucket, which is perfectly fine. You can do both, but I find this way to be more convenient. So now that I've strained the first water out, I want to go ahead and get the rest of this water out just so I can, you know, be nice and really, really wash. This is my first time using it. So I just want to be, yeah, I can see it's the soap. So I'm happy that I did this. And I actually place it on chairs just so that I can, I guess I will have to go buy a stand um, that can fit perfectly in this space right here. 
I know some videos I've seen people put it in their tub, but I want to have it sit in one place so then it can always be right there. So, yeah, I think that's pretty cool. It's doing what needs to be done. So, I wonder if it can drain from up there, but I, I doubt it. <laughs> Cause that would be like that would be cool but yeah super excited but i also have this bucket down here so that I can drink. But all right that's just gonna do that and then we'll come back to see how this spinning process go i'll see how to do that way to go okay so then the next time i come back i'll actually be doing spinning it and then doing another load to see how that works and i actually really like it it's really compact it's really cute and it's literally just what i was looking for so i'm appreciative of that and i just want to say a quick hello hello people but yeah i really like it so i'm back as you can probably hear the water from the machine is actually draining and then the dryer is actually spinning I wanted to make sure, oh, and I actually set it up here until I go and actually get a real stand because obviously the water drains better like this. I like that the water can run through like that. But um, yeah, so it's draining. We're gonna let that come over. Let it spin another time. I'll let it drain for more, for more clean water and actually wash just to get the rest of the stuff out. So I would definitely be back. I just want to add this clip in before I do the final take. But I guess I can show you the process. I even washed this big blanket. This is actually a big blanket in there, just to see if I can do it. And I washed these things. So that was, this is the, the color load that I did. And the first thing, just to be on the safe side, I think I only washed like those two things. And then once I saw how well those washed, I ended up washing that and then I did a white load, which was, I don't have that many whites. It was that shirt, those towels, that, that blanket. And it actually washed. And then I washed, so that's a total of, that's one, two, three, four loads, five. I washed five loads already, got, the other towel and the dryer so five loads and then i'll have this as my final load i'm thinking about if i want to do my comforter don't know i'm pushing the limit but i just want to see but yeah so it actually just got done spinning because it only spins for five minutes so i'm gonna give it another five minutes because at first i was spinning it the wrong way i didn't know how to spin it so like, why is it not making any sound but now i see that Pretty, I'm really excited about this. I'm really happy. It's a great investment thus far. And I just want to, you know, take care of it so I can continue to use it. And then I can't wait to, you know, store it in a cute place once I get like a nice table for it to sit on and then I'll be all good. But stay tuned, I will be back. Hi everyone, it's me. And I just wanted to conclude this video of my, ta-da! my portable washer and dryer. When I tell you I love it, I absolutely love it. I wanted to come once I've like completely used it and I can say since I got it hmm, Tuesday, I think I've washed at least 10 things of clothes and I am be unimpressed because like it has a lot of power, like a lot of power for the size that is small. And you know, normally we don't like small. But you know, that's another story. <laughs> but this machine, it does what it needs to do. So if I was you, I would go and get it quick because for, I think I paid a total of $130. Uh, tax, it was probably like one, 150. It was free shipping. I would definitely, if I would have known about this a year ago or like, man, months ago, I would have bought it. Like, why not? Like the spinner is absolutely like great. Like it damn near dries it. The washer is great. Like it is awesome. It fits right in this, you know, little space right here. It's perfect. Like I have no complaints. It's not loud at all. Um, it'll probably be like a mash of videos just of me raving about this, but I don't, I don't can't pronounce it right. It is Lou. Yemeni, help with that.
because it's Z-O-K-O-P. Is it pop? <laughs> Zopop? Zotop? I don't know, but it is awesome. I will leave it in the description below. Please go and get it and let them know who sent you, Kyla B. Um, so yeah, go and get that real quick. Bye.